say the same thing every single time. Is this thing on? What is happening? my friends, ladies and gentlemen of YouTube. It's been a cool minute. I haven't seen you guys since 2017. It's January 22nd. It's January 2nd, I thought that joke was great. It's been a minute, last video I did was um, October 31st, it was the Halloween carving pumpkin video. Um, I could I could sit here and talk the story of how I was at Starbucks, quit Starbucks and now I'm at the bar and all that and how I was working both. I don't really care. I don't think you guys care either. It's a story for another time. Anyway, we're gonna jump right into what we're doing today. Today we're going to, uh, so when Johnny, that's another thing, Johnny moved out. He uh, couldn't afford the rent anymore, so he moved back to Los Banos. Uh, we'll miss the dude. Uh, Mikey, a bartender uh, at Cork and Fly where I work, moved into the other room also. So that's a little quick little update. When Johnny was living here, one of us somehow, maybe there's a little alcohol involved, someone broke the goddamn toilet seat, and it's been cracked ever since, and when you got two guys living in a, sharing a bathroom, we're not gonna worry about that, but we gotta fix it before the new roommate moves in. So they're moving in um, on the sixth. So I gotta fix that up, I gotta clean the bathroom. You know, I did it before, but when someone was supposed to walk through, after after Johnny moved out, I cleaned it up, it looked really good. And I haven't cleaned it since, and it's been like a, probably a cool, cool month. So it's time I do that. So, but first things first, I gotta fix that toilet seat. And hopefully I find one that matches it. Cause it's like one of those round ones. It's not one of those like pointy ones, but we'll go see. Do you guys don't know about that? No. Yeah, the toilet seat we have is cracked. Why, did you sit on it? I don't know, I came in there one, I came in there one time and I was like, hey dude, what happened to the toilet seat? And he goes, I don't know. I know, it, only one of us could have broken it. Yeah. It wasn't me. Like I would be, I'd be like, "Fuck it, I, I did it," you know. Yeah. I mean, I figured I'd, I'd fix yeah, it anyway. Probably but did the same thing because he didn't have any money to pay for it. Probably. I mean, I wouldn't have charged if he would have told me. Yeah, I broke it. I'd be like, "Oh, cool." I'm gonna no way. Johnny, you broke the toilet seat. I'm gonna ask him. I'm gonna hit him up. He hit me up last night when I was in Los Banos. Anyway, I'm gonna go do that. I was trying to. I was trying to. I'm gonna go cut the laces on these. A little well, long. I don't know. Guess how much money I lost last night. Oh, Guess how much? How much? You, how much, Lexi? Guess how much you think I lost? Lost. Lost money. Go? Casino. Six hundred. Oh, oh no. Fifty. Eighty. Oh, that's not bad. Yeah, I went in, dude. I I fucked up. So I went in. I gave twenty dollars. I put it all in red for my homies and I all wanted to go in. First twenty go, goes, and then the second twenty. I sit down in a coin machine because I was like, you know what? I was like, I want to enjoy this time. I'm let, and I was one of those one centers. So I just was doing that, and I got down. And like I was up, like I went up like the 30. And I was like, dude, I should probably cash out. I was like, you don't know, I don't know how many people went on these. And so I was like, now nah, I'm gonna keep going. So I started going down to 10, and I was like, damn, fuck this. And I thought the the money that goes in, into the machine saves you your card because you put a card in there. Yeah. And I swear, the first time I did that, it all went onto my card. But it didn't do that. And so I, I, I lost 10 bucks that way. But then I went to the blackjack table. I put down 20, lost it right away. And there's this Asian lady and like I sat down and she was like, I put down five and she goes, put down 10. And I was like, no, nah, I'm gonna lose. Like I always lose the first hand. She goes, just put down 10. And I was like, all right, if I win, I'm gonna listen to you this whole game. She goes, okay. And I fucking won. And then it comes again. She has a two. And I was like, and I'm like, she's like, just trust me on it. And so she, I did it and fucking won. And so I was up 80. <laughs> I went, I just was listening to this Asian girl. She leaves, I start losing. And I was like down to like 30, off this 20, off this 20. And I was like, God damn, where's that Asian lady? I started looking around. <laughs> She's not around. And so I walk away for a minute. I go, all right, fuck it, whatever. And I come back and all my homies are like chilling behind me. And then I'm like, I get down to 20. I was like, you know what, fuck man. I, I'm feeling good, I'm gonna win. And so I put it all in. I fucking got it back, and so I was like, all right, good. I should have walked away. Should've. Should've walked away, but I got up to 50, and I was like, dude, I'm chilling, I'm chilling, I'm having a good old time. I don't know how, but it drained down to 20, so I walked away, and my homie asked, hey guys, is the table hot? And the guy goes, fuck no, and I'm like, fuck it, 20 down. 
boom, I get a two, and I'm like, okay, not bad, I guess, I can work with that. Then I get a four, and then it's like a ace, and then another two, and I'm like, all right, fuck. And I'm like, all right, fuck it, hit, face, face card, and I was just like, god damn! So she hold me down every time I hit her up. When I get right, I promise that we gon' live it up. She made me beg for it till she give it up. And I say the same thing every single time. It's